Greetings and salutations. Today we'll take a look at the Gospel Expansion for Easy Drummer 3. Billions of people just living out their lives. Oblivious. <laughs> So this expansion, done in collaboration with Denny Duncan, has been on my radar for a while. After listening to the demos on the Toontrack site, I thought for sure that I'd want to try this out. It comes with a great array of MIDI beats, played by Calvin Rogers. I'm always a fan of the MIDI grooves that come with Toontrack expansions. And while this one is not really suited to metal, they can definitely be used in some of the softer parts of my songs. As for the kits, it comes with five kits and an array of extra percussion pieces. This one also comes with dual snares, so you can have one snare and a side snare. Excellent for creating some variation in your songs. The toms sound great, but the one thing that I was a little disappointed with was the cymbals. They're very high-end and harsh, if that makes any sense. It took me a little while, but I was able to find a preset that I was able to work with to create my own preset and put it in one of my metal songs which you just heard. This also proves that just because an expansion is not necessarily a metal expansion, it doesn't mean that you can't use them in the metal genre. What I would like to do is revisit this later on down the track and change out some of the symbols for symbols from other kits such as Dark Matter or even the Progressive Kit because other than the symbols, I really think this is a fantastic sounding expansion. So what we'll do now is jump over to my computer, have a listen to some presets so you can hear what comes with the expansion. Please like and subscribe as always, and enjoy indeed. Thanks guys. Okay, greetings and salutations guys. So instead of doing a mix rundown this time, I thought what I'd do is I'd just build a little thing, a little groove thing in, uh, in Easy Drummer, and then show off some of the presets for the gospel kit. Um, because a lot of the presets won't suit my mix that I did for uh, metal so I just wanted to show off some of the grooves in case you were thinking of picking this up because I think some of the kits that sound amazing especially this basic modern gospel kit the very first kit sounds huge sounds fantastic sounds alive let's give it a listen
That snare sounds amazing. Absolutely amazing. I love how snappy that snare is. It sounds fantastic. The toms also sound very like, you, like you're basically sitting at the kit with it, which I really like. All right, let's check out a couple of other ones. Uh, let's check out maybe uh, the Tight Retro Soul kit. Very nice, very nice. All right, let's uh, modern punchy comp. Really nice ring in that snare, I love it. Very nice, very nice. All right, uh, let's go Golden Boom. Very nice, very nice. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> soul Pillow. Very tight, very nice. Okay, uh, let's check out a couple of the tune track ones here. This is big. Beautiful reverb. Very nice. Uh, let's see. We'll do Trickster next. There we go. Okay, now I'll show you what I came up with for my preset here. This is probably as metal as I could get this kit sounding.
sweet second one, which is only slightly different. So there you go guys, gospel kit, few of the presets. Uh, if you're definitely into rock or something like that, I'd definitely recommend picking this one up. Um, as far as metal goes, I think there's definitely other kits that you would pick up if you don't have them before you picked up this one. I really like this one, I don't regret picking it up. Sounds really good, especially uh, if I'm in a rock mood, feel like doing some rock numbers or something a little softer. So there you go. Enjoy indeed as always, guys.